Our first guest tonight is a remarkably resilient human being with a Grammy, a Guinness World Record, two Emmys, and all the Kardashian Jenner cell phone numbers in her, in her iPhone. You can see her on season five of the show Search Party, premiering January 7th on HBO Max. Please welcome Kathy Griffin. <laughs> I was worried you would be like low energy, but boy, aren't you are not. <laughs> Never. Okay, so I have to explain my voice, you guys. Listen to my voice. So I had surgery. You're not going to believe this. So I've never smoked, but I got lung cancer. And in August, I had half of my left lung removed. I'm not even kidding. And so now they like put the intubation tube to rub on my vocal cord. So now I'm like Minnie Mouse meets Marilyn Monroe. I'm not sure. I have to say. <laughs> I kind of like birthday it. Happy birthday! Well, you, you need to get, you need to do some animation fast before right. that heals up. You know. It will heal, but I'm sort of enjoying it. I'm like a good two octaves higher, I think. Is it two octaves? It really? might be. It's higher than Mariah Carey. I know that. Um, <laughs> well, it's okay, perfect. So, I also want to explain my attire, James. Oh yeah. Okay. Yeah. I can't believe that you're like dressed nicer than I am, that's <laughs> wrong. So during COVID, I gained 20 pounds. So now that I'm like a big lady, I'm curvy. Um, <laughs> yeah, I'm a plus size model now. Uh -huh. so, so now I can't fit into any of my like size two stuff. So now I just wear Gucci track suits. <laughs> yeah, and um, I, I like it. You look great. Do you buy them online or do you go into the store and try them on? Well, even though I'm too famous to go to stores, I, <laughs> I did. First of all, I should say that my inspiration was like many people during COVID, I rewatched Sopranos and I was like, I want to dress like Big Pussy. <laughs> <laughs> and I, I, I manifested that. So, yes, I do. I go in the store. I don't mean to be rude, but this whole getup with the fanny pack and the shoes, it costs more than you make in a year. I'm not going to lie. More it's expensive, year. right? So I'm chubby or roly poly, but I'm also, um, I look rich. <laughs> so. Well, you don't look the slightest bit chubby or roly poly, but you do look very, very wealthy. And, and you, did the doctors get it all? They got all yes. that lung cancer out so of there? I'm cancer free. That's great news. Okay, so um, I don't know why. I had like a tumor, right? And I've never smoked. And it was in there for 10 years. So get this. They, um, wow. they took it out and they found it on like another scan. All right, so I go in and here's the thing. When you're a comic, it's horrible when the doctors want to like do their material on you. So no joke. So I go in and he's like <laughs> describing how they take half your lung out and he goes, it's kind of like a balloon. So we do it laparoscopically and we poke it. And then he goes, and when we take it out, it kind of looks like a used condom. <laughs> the doctor. And then he, no, no, and then he goes, you can use that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, how generous of him. And in so a way, you just I, did. I just did. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> and insurance covered it. <laughs> yes. Wow, so you got a joke courtesy of insurance. That I is did. the best thing I a did. comedian also, could ask for. You know, I, you know, I love the gays, Jimmy. You know, that's always been You my are, um, I love would them. you say, are you a leader in the gay community? I would like to say that I think any gay knows that there is an open door at Mrs. Kathy's house. And yes. A and beacon, a beacon. It's really. a beacon of hope. Mm -hmm. And now that I live in Malibu, I want to be like Streisand, where the gays have to make like a sojourn to come see me. Right. And then I, they come and sit before me and I judge them. I see. So, <laughs> it's like a mini, mini RuPaul at my house every day. Is that what Barbara does? She judges them? She yes. lines them up and judges them? Yes, wow. and they <laughs> love it. They're like, next week I want to be number three. Yeah. I and like that RuPaul direction for you. So, because of my lung surgery, I wanted to have a new drag name. So for years, I've had Safonda 
for years. Uh huh. All oh, right. And, okay. Yeah. And so I thought this time I should do like a drag name should have like sort of a nod to someone fabulous. So I was like, okay, the gays love Eva Longoria. What if I'm Diva Half a Longoria? I like it. I like it. <laughs> I mean, technically, it's not correct. You have one full lung, not I half do. a lung. But I you, do. you know what? Go with it, I think. I'm going to. Why oh, also, you know, it's terrible. I am the worst at playing the cancer card. Like, ask me to do any, like, benign thing. Like, just ask me to do anything. Hey, would you mind, you know, we're going to actually, uh, we're doing a charity event. We're trying to get some people to pack boxes. For... Okay, really? A charity freaking event? I mean, like, ask oh. me to get you something. Oh, okay. <laughs> but I would never. Of course, I'm What's my motivation? <laughs> Kathy, would you run and get me a mochaccino? I have too much cancer. <laughs> so I... <laughs> I feel like the answer would have been no anyway, you well, know? <laughs> this, yeah. your, this show, Search Party, what, this is the fifth season of the, of okay, the show. Okay, so get this. So you guys know I'm canceled, right? Like, I was like, canceled, canceled. And so I'm very yeah. slowly getting canceled. And what I think is funny is that People are kind of like afraid of me now and all that stuff. And you know, like that guy Paul Gosar made a video and yeah, so like I was like Arizona. back on the news again. So yeah. anyway, so I think I'm gonna get uncanceled. I think I'm an actress again, guys. Which is like. Yeah. I, 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 I never acknowledge your canceling anyway. I rejected your cancel. Just you, reject your cancel. By the way, you were really, really, of the people I can count on one hand. That rejected my cancellation. Yes, it was ridiculous. Of course, it was ridiculous. <laughs> you were un officially uncanceled by uh, order of Guillermo and I. Yes. Oh, so, thank you, Guillermo. Yeah. Oh, you're welcome. Oh, my God, Kathy, gracias. Not only are you not canceled, you're now part of the show, which I'm is a very HBO funny Max show. show. It's called Search Party, and apparently the young kids don't know that I'm a terrorist. Like, you know, the magas think I'm a terrorist. Right, yeah, so yeah. They don't even know that stuff. They watch the Tic Tac. And uh, so uh, yeah. <laughs> they watch the dancing on the Tic Tac, and they love that. You know the kids. And so what's great is the young gays think they've discovered me. <laughs> oh, is that right? <laughs> I do want to show a <laughs> clip from your show. Yes, please do. And then, per, and then you will explain the character after. I'm very excited. Yes, so I'm okay. an actress again. Get this ready. From Search Party, Kathy Griffin. <laughs> you ever got a new boss without even a heads up? I didn't think so. Makes you want to clench your <laughs> so tight it ruptures like hell. These people know He's your here. name. They know how you like to scratch your legs. They even know the Rolodex of attractive people you keep in your head when you go to pleasure yourself. <laughs> okay. There's an algorithm for all of it. Time. You're just sandwiches to them. That's right. I'm talking to you. And you, and you, and you, and you. She's back, Kathy Griffin. <laughs> You're playing a crazy person. Yeah. I'm, I'm so excited because I love that look of the character. It's kind of like Patti Smith meets <laughs> QAnon. It's like yes, Pat, it if is. Patty Smith was in QAnon, that's my <laughs> character. And so I'm super obsessed with like people like believing all these conspiracy theories. So I go online and I like, I don't troll, but I what's called lurking. And I follow all that <laughs> stuff. Like you do. Like I watch the Mike Lindell 96 hour telethon. Oh yeah, the My Pillow guy, yes. yeah. Oh yeah. I'm my pillow guy. So I've had to learn about all the QAnon stuff because they think I um eat baby blood with Hillary Clinton. Uh-huh, so yes, yes. When that comes into your life, you want to <laughs> Do a little research and development. So, <laughs> so, and for the record, that never happened, right? I've not eaten any babies. You no. have not eaten any I babies. Have, I have not harvested anything. <laughs> maybe, maybe a ear of corn. All right, so, so it was very exciting. I almost lost the job because when I was talking to the producers, I was so excited because I had done so much research on QAnon. I had them on the Zoom call for like eight hours. So <laughs> you I think they you think indoctrinated them. Yes. I also want to mention very a very character. special event that happened in your life <gasps> quite quietly and secretly, which is rare for you, Kathy. <laughs> you got married. Now, <laughs> you and... Now, I assume... I don't know, either you and Lily Tomlin got married or you and Randy got married. 
Um, my boyfriend of many years, we've now been together 10 years, Randy, and I got married. And the coolest thing is, we did it last New Year's Eve, and we got Lily Tomlin to officiate. That's pretty great. Yeah. How much does she charge for that? She was uh, $75,000. Oh, really? Plus, okay. Plus a lot of lesbian expenses. So it's, you know, it's a golf club membership, it's a, a full dog rescue facility. There's a dinosaur worship ceremony. That we have. Is that right? There's an award show. You want to win a dino? So anyway, I have material. I, I get the. <laughs> okay. So. Did you go on it? Did you have like a reception, a party, or anything it was like so that? So much fun. So it was New Year's Eve, and I called her, and she and her wife Jane came over. They were over for like an hour. The whole wedding is like 18 minutes. I actually put it on YouTube because it's so charming. Our dogs, we had two puppies, they were like climbing up my dress. And it was just loose and silly and fun. It was just a really fun Well, that's to do great. It. Congratulations. And I'm glad you're alive. <laughs> I'm glad you're back. Kathy Griffin is back. Season five of Search Party, January 7th, HBO Max. We'll be back with Alan Ruff. Congratulations on making it to the end of a YouTube video. Why not celebrate by clicking the subscribe button? You earned it.